What's up guys? I'm Nick Perez and welcome back to this week's Leopard Spotlight. First up, we got Yamoto walking around the school asking students some deep life questions. I'm Yamoto Ingram, and what are your deep thoughts? What's the meaning of life? Alright, so the meaning of life can be interpreted different ways by a lot of people. Finding what makes you happy. I think the meaning of life is to have fun. The meaning of life is uh, being happy. Different people live for different things. You know, some people live to be happy, and some people live because they feel like they're obligated to do something. Um, I'd say making good relationships, um, doing things that make you happy, and finding your passion. I think that it's that you can do stuff. Um, <laughs> that's a good question. <laughs> and some people feel like they should only live for themselves or for other people. To embarrass Parker Ebb. In my opinion, it's making money. So, you know, it's kind of up to interpretation, but I guess biologically speaking, you have children, so. How do you want to be remembered? Um, for being a famous surgeon. Definitely not something bad. Y'all, I want to be remembered as, like, mad evil. Anyways, did we find out what the meaning of life was? Probably not, but that's not the point. The point is that the meaning of life is very subjective. Uh, make sure to do your homework, study for those uh, major tests that are coming up. I'm Imato Ingram. Thank you for watching What Are Your Deep Thoughts? I'm signing out. Next up, Jungle Productions brings us all we need to know about our leopard athletes and the sports they star. Here's Noah Nadu with this week's Leopard Recap. Welcome to the fifth segment of Leopard Recap. I'm Noah Nadu. The varsity football team defeated Frisco Memorial on Thursday by a score of 53-0, to improving the team's record to 6-0. The team's next game is on Friday in Lake Dallas at 7 p.m. The varsity volleyball team defeated Wiley East on Friday. The team's next game is against Sherman at home at 6 p.m. The varsity hockey team was defeated by Prosper on Thursday by a score of 5-2. The team's next game is tomorrow against Plano West at the Plano Rink at 8 p.m. Thank you for joining us on Leopard Recap. Make sure to check out Jungle Productions' Instagram at underscore Jungle Productions underscore. Catch you guys next week. Wow, those Leopards had a great week of sports, especially our cross-country team. Let's go take a deeper dive into their last race. This week's featured athlete, Kyle Parker. Here's Gardner. Welcome to another weekly edition of Player of the Week. I'm Noah Gardner. The Leopards completed their first shutout of the Chris Ross era with a score of 53 to nothing. Our Player of the Week is tight end, Will Branham. Branham is the first tight end in Lovejoy history to catch a touchdown pass listed as a tight end. Thank you for watching Player of the Week. Be sure to follow us on Instagram at underscore Jungle Productions underscore. Till then, see you next week. And staying on the topic of sports, some Lovejoy High School students chase an adrenaline rush by performing motocross and modding some unexpected vehicles. Oh, I thought it was... Oh! Really feeling the zen in this next segment. I haven't, I like, literally haven't seen anything like this since like 2019, so I don't know how to. Hey guys, this is ASMR with Carter and Chloe. First up on the agenda, we have balls in the form of cheese. 
These are so stale. I might have to spit this out. What did they put in these? This is a bottle. <laughs> that was a little aggressive. Go out on the street now. I'm Jagger. Hi. You know what I'm saying? I just feel it in your mind. So, uh, give us your best ASMR impression. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Wait, redo that, redo that. I'm gonna play hot girls buns. <laughs> Third and final take. Yeah, I totally see your side, man. Oh, wait, I gotta call you back real quick. So sorry, guys. I was just talking to a new Lovejoy Productions phone number. You know what? I'll make you a deal. If you call me and leave me a funny voice message or tell us what to feature next time, you can be on the next episode. Here, I'll give you the number. It's 469-573-0168. Well, that's everything. See you next time.